Hello friends and welcome back to another Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 playthrough. Today we're going to do Crazy Castle, one of the three beginner scenarios. A very fun one, but one that is strangely difficult to beat despite being a beginner scenario. So let's start by eliminating some of the unnecessary scenery and taking that as capital to begin work. It looks like we've started with guests already in the park. Let's eliminate this castle and reveal the paths. One of the big problems with this scenario is guests frequently get lost and stuck on these paths because of all the dead ends and strange, um, oh, that's not going to work. Oops. They frequently get lost in the paths. Let's just leave it at that. Let's include paths and begin eliminating some of these redundant paths that we don't want. And be careful not to hit any trees because trees are beneficial and they are expensive to remove. Oh, I hit one. Darn it. Shabam. That was $500 right there. Just that tower alone. This is going to be great. Double paths can be a problem for the pathfinding of these guys, but we're just going to leave it as it is. It's probably fine. And we have random floating. Are they over the trees? That's going to bug me if I don't get rid of them. There we go. Much better. Let's remove the double path here. We can let this consolidate into a single path and eliminate this doubling here because that will cause problems in the future. This loop is redundant, so let's get rid of it, as is this one. And this poor guy is lost in the wilderness. Here you go, buddy. Kathy S. Oh, wait, I still need to get rid of these paths. Perfect. And with that, we are ready to begin. Let's crank up our science research to maximum and turn off everything except shops and stalls because the biggest bottleneck for this scenario is the cash machine. It's about to start raining, so let's get some umbrellas up for sale. Same price throughout park. Let's charge 120 for our maps. People are coming to the park and there isn't even anything to see. That's, I guess that's a testament to how easy this scenario is supposed to be. Let's see what we have to work with. We have some gentle rides, some thrill rides. I'm going to use Splash Mine. Splash Mine is just so overpowered. Insane throughput. So how do I want to do this? Let's flip it. Turn around. Sweet. Actually, don't test. Do I have the maximum number of boats? Okay, I already do. Perfect. Let's do what we did in, I think it was Factory Capers? No, it was in Electric Fields. We put a turntable in here. Reverse turntable to make things more exciting. And we'll replace this one with a photo section. So we can get additional profits from this ride. Admission price, I think we could get away with $8 on this. And for tickets... 3.5. Wonderful. While that's testing, let's add some other rides. I got a copyright uh, violation with the merry-go-round in the Factory Capers video. Fortunately, it didn't... Uh, it, it wasn't a copyright strike, so the, the video was allowed to stay up, but one of the songs in the merry-go-round is uh, <laughs> copyrighted, <laughs> which... I didn't. I was so surprised by that. So I'm going to stick this over here at the entrance so I don't have to listen to it so much. So I'm less likely to have that segment of music interrupt my gameplay. Because that would be unfortunate. And I think that one is safe. We can let that one play in the background. It's the one that goes... Da -da 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 -da, and then has the drums. Da -da 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 -da. I might get copyright strike for doing that. It's <laughs> just with my voice. YouTube is that good at catching it. Is this open yet? No, it's not. Okay. On second thought. Will people still ride this with that music? Okay, I feel like I just did something horribly wrong. I just I just killed the soul of Roller Coaster Tycoon <laughs> by turning that off. I can't do that. Uh, what I need to do though is change the price. What am I doing? I could charge more than this. There we go. Come on, Splash Mine. Finish, finish, finish. 
This ride has some great throughput. We can get some money off of this bad boy. I'm going to put it here. Let you test. And I think I can get away with four dollars on this one, actually. Maybe even five. What's the stats on this? Oh, it's still testing. Never mind. What else? Twist. So I think we can have our central area here. We have our flat rides and our drinks and stalls. And then our roller coasters can branch out to this outer area. Oh. Oh, that reminds me. I can zoom in now. Look at this. <laughs> get really up close and pixely. <laughs> I lost my voice for a second. What this also means is I fixed the problem that I had where, for whatever reason, the uh, OBS, I called it OSB in the last episode, which is kind of embarrassing. That's a kind of a lumber, a kind of engineer lumber, oriented strand board or something. But I did, I changed something in the settings where instead of full screen, I went to full, full screen borderless and somehow that fixed it. So we're back in business. I think this should be ready now. Yep, open for business. How much can we charge for this? Let's try, let's risk $3. I don't know if we'll be able to get away with that though. Let's see if anyone gets in line. Well, they're paying four for this one. That's a good sign. Anybody? Any takers? That was a reject uh, rejection. More thrilling, he says. Okay, I'm I'm too scared. I'm gonna turn this off. I don't know if that's gonna be a problem later. Uh, how about this? How about this? Can I use other music with this, or am I forced to? No, no, no. That's the one that got me in trouble. <laughs> I can't let that one play. Uh, no one is thinking about this ride and no one's paying for it. Let me just bring this down a little bit. There we go. Let's actually have something a little more... Uh, let's put a Ferris wheel over here. Not in the trees. Don't want to ruin it. Gentle style. This is one that's really pretty. And it's it's a testament to the skill of the of the composer of the music for this game that he could have a minor key sound so positive. Which is unusual, because minor usually sounds sad, but this sounds mysterious and and uh what's the word? Introspective. And it's very pretty, I love it. Okay, what else do we add to this? Oh, I didn't I didn't adjust the price. Whoops. I could probably get away with two bucks for this. At least until it becomes old. Is anyone riding the Ferris wheel? Not the Ferris wheel, the the merry go Oh, no one wants to ride on it. It's too boring. <laughs> oh well. Now that we have Splash Mine is probably going to be our biggest money maker until I get some proper roller coasters built. So let's build a wooden roller coaster. I always like to start with woodies. To me, they are the most aesthetically attractive roller coasters. Let's put it over here. What roller coaster trains do I have access to? Yeah, just a boring one. Okay. What must I do to get two trains? Oh, there we go. That's two trains. Perfect. So we start at 30. This is 50 feet. Okay, that looks weird. Let's uh, do this. Now we're below the, the level we started in. Let's lower it some more. That's not going to work. Let's straighten, let's uh, extend that. We'll keep it curved and then raise it up. 
There we go. Can I sneak under this? Aw, oh, man, that would have been so cool. That's not going to work either. Okay, I guess we can't do that. We can't go under our little heat licks, but we can go down back to ground level. I ran out of room, darn it. Oh, that's cool. Can't do that. Too bad. <laughs> Look at that. We made like a pretzel. That's so cool. I'm guessing I don't have room for that. Nope, I don't. But I do have room here. So let's put a photo section right there. And we've had a lot of a lot of clockwise. So let's we only have one counterclockwise turn. So let's turn around. Another helix. A little dip. Let's keep that curve so the track doesn't doesn't look so awkward. Where did we come out? That won't work either. Um. That also won't work. Can I do... Nope, I can't do that. Let's try to duck under here. Actually, no, no, no. Keep going down. Can I squeeze through here? No, the ground is in the way. Okay, never mind. This roller coaster is really busy on this side. I need to go over there and do something with it. Okay, I should have known that wouldn't have worked. Wouldn't have worked. Man, I didn't know how to speak English. <laughs> And I've corded myself. Well, that didn't work. Let's uh, turn sooner. And that won't work because that's not owned by the park. Um. Well, I do like this double helix thing we have going on, but I can't keep. I can't carry it on like that. Sub sandwich stall. Cool. That reminds me, we don't have any amenities for our guests. Let's fix that right now. What do we have here? I guess the only real food source we have is the sub sandwich and the hot dog. Let's have a sub sandwich over here under the splash mine. And I'm gonna try not making this excessively expensive. So let's make that two and a half dollars. Same price throughout park. And Lemonade. We'll flank it. Lemonade. Oops. Oops, come back. Let me fix that price. Two dollars. So it's a little spendy, but not too excessively spendy. Helix this up. Can I go over this? Oh, I can! Fancy that. I'm not going to make it up if I'm not careful, so let's helix this down a little bit. Can we snake slither? Oh, we can slither around it. Beautiful! Although we're going to run into that wall there, so let's uh, not do that. Let's actually... I can't do that either. What the heck? S bend. S bend. <laughs> we'll call that the serpentine section. That looks kind of kind of wonky, but it's fine. I'm cool with it. If we put a water splash here, can we make it back up without a lift hill? I don't want to push my leg.
Whoops. Let's just have this little hop. Can I... No, I can't. That's too bad. Unless... Ooh! I can do that. And I should have used up my momentum by this point, so I should be able to get away with that unbanked turn right there. I apologize <laughs> if my voice sounds a little weird. I do have a cold, so my nose is a little plugged, a little runny. Okay, I'm going to bank that just because I can. I have space for it. I'm not going to mess around with that. Much better. Oh, wait. I need an entrance and an exit. Put the entrance there. Exit over here. And... Turn the lift hill up. Test. While that's running in the background, let's build our entrance. Our paths. Let's do green. We haven't done green since I started making these roller coaster tycoon videos. While she's running. Oh, look, I used up all my money. Almost all of it. What other options do we have? Bumper cars? trying to be a little more spaced out. I said I was going to do that in the factory caper scenario, and I did overall, but there was a few spots that were just really, really densely packed together, and it didn't look very good. How's the money on this? Ooh, not bad, not bad. Based on the ratings, that seems about right. We have 296 guests. I once again forgot to look at how to win this. Uh, year four, this is going to be a very, very long scenario unless we do a lot of fast forwarding. 150 guests, or 1,500 guests with a park rating of 600. All right, well, let's do that. Has this finished yet? Oh, those are beautiful stats. I'm liking that. Well, but first, can we charge 15? We have, these are both high, seven and a half, six and a half. Is 15 too much? No, this guy's going for it. All right. So this will probably be our primary source of income for a while. Let's see if we can get people into the park by advertising this wooden roller coaster. Maybe free food. Come in for your free sub sandwiches. And free rides on the Ferris wheel since no one likes it. <laughs> is this too expensive? Yeah, this is too expensive. Okay, back down to a dollar get people off of the pathways so they actually oh I didn't change the price of this no 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 I hit delete before I actually selected this I think you can charge three dollars for this one whoa I didn't know I could use the, the mouse wheel to do that I'm such a noob <laughs> you'd think you'd think I would know how to play this after all this time this was still cranking out money not bad for a flat ride 2,000 per hour 2,400 very good very good What's the status on these? Let's tuck a bathroom over here. I can get away with that. When people are desperate, they must pee. <laughs> Let's have ice cream for our guests. They like they need their sweets, you know. Let's raise this to a buck fifty. And just for the heck of it, add something just to fill in this space. I know I just said I wanted to not w uh, be too compact, but mazes are aesthetic things. They they don't really produce a lot of money, I don't think. Actually, maybe they can, with just from the volume of guests that go through them. Exit entrance. And open for a dollar. No limit to the people that could go in here. And 
there is a running cost of $49 per hour, so basically $50 per hour. Although it seems like this is cranking out. Look at this. They're just going right in. Okay, this will probably be fine. That will be great. What's the situation here? 11000 per hour, not bad. Nothing fancy yet compared to Splash Mine. It's getting us pretty much double that. Let's pay down our loan. Our loan is not horrible, or our interest, I mean. 5% per year. So that's nothing to be too concerned about, although we should try to pay it off. No cash machine yet. What do we have going on here? Candy up, so that's what we just learned. Balloons! We need balloons. Random color. Let's make them a little cheaper so we have more of them by the end of the scenario. Okay, this serpent section is weird, but it still looks good overall. I like this. I wonder if I can stick any scenery in this empty space right here since it's kind of lacking somewhat. Although it's a slope, so hmm, maybe trees? Nice walnut. Well, that's not a walnut, it's an oak tree. Let's get some fir trees. I messed up my supports. Whoops. Honey locust. There we go. Looks a little more full now. Beautiful. And I love this music so much, it's so pretty. After a while, it might start to be a little annoying though, so I might switch it for something else or just turn it off. Whichever. Let's say change this entrance to wooden. Or no, this is medieval. What am I thinking? Brown castle. Same with this one, since we this is <laughs> crazy castle. Although I deleted everything about the castle, so I could I guess I could do what I want. What should we name this place? Now nah, I'm just gonna leave it. Leave it as it is. It's a crazy castle, y'all. Come get your hats, folks. Come get your hats. Make that random. Crank this up to three fifty. I think is a safe price. In factory capers were made at four dollars, and they were selling, but they weren't selling as much as they could because a lot of people weren't willing to spend that much. See, there we go. Look at that. People are buying them right away. Advertising campaign is done. Let's do a campaign for the whole park, and a campaign for Splash Mine. Let's actually turn this off, and turn on this one. Kind of mysterious and eerie and scary. What is this called? Water style? Yeah, it's water style. Okay. What's the situation, science? Shops and stalls. Oh, I clicked the wrong thing. July 1st. Let's speed things along a bit. Turn that down. We have more guests coming in, and we have two major money makers, so that's good. Although we're going to plateau as soon as our guests run out of money, and then our only source of income will be new guests as opposed to the existing guests. That'll seriously bottleneck us. Hot chocolate? That's pretty much useless. Well, I guess we have to wait. That's too bad. What's the situation? One week remaining on these? Alright. Advertise the park again. Advertise the wooden roller coaster. Free food or drink? Let's advertise our ice cream. Come get your free ice cream. Three rides on the pirate ship, and it sounds like something just broke down. That means it's time to get some staff. <laughs> I've been saving money up to this point, but we can't do that forever. We need staff. I wish there was a way to close all of these windows at once. If there's like a, a trick to do that, let me know, because I'm not aware of them if there are any. So your guests are kind of grossed out over here because they keep stepping in the vomit. Because the park benches, what do we have? We have... Yeah, I'm going to do the fancier one, because why not? No one needs to know that this is a castle scenario with a lack of technology. Well, it's a theme park, of course it's technology. 
I mean technology and the theming. Here we have uh, wooden benches with steel frames. That's good. Let's get some garbage cans. We only have two types. I like this one better. It's a little prettier to look at. Splash mine hasn't been fixed. Where's the where's the mechanic? Huh. He's probably on his way. That should suffice. Oh, he's it's in the process of fixing it. Okay. Let's turn down alone some more. Yep, yeah, there it goes. Music started again. How much longer for these bad boys? Very nice, very nice. What did we just learn? What did we just get? What was that? Sunglasses? Okay. Guests are disgusted by the path. Where are they? And where are they seeing this disgusting path? Is that right here? Hmm. Yeah, it looks like it's right there. Handyman probably got it before I could see it. All right, so. Loan is paid off. Officially, although if I want to add more rides, I'll probably have to turn that back up. Let's get a wild mouse. Wild mouse. Wild mice. I don't know. Wild mouse roller coasters can be a great source of income. Let's crank this up. Back to 10,000. Just because we can. I said this was designated for flat rides, but I, wild mouses kind of count as flat rides because of the way they're shaped, I guess. Let's put it right here. No, I want to be compact. That's right. Not compact. That's what I meant. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that gives room for eight. Uh, eight cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Okay. Turn. Lift hill. One of five minus thirty. So that's uh, what is that? Seventy-five feet tall. I think is the limit for this. Let's start with a switchback section, where you dip at the beginning, run straight. I guess dip on every other switchback, I suppose. So there's a lot of redundant track here, but it looks so cool, though. Or, I mean, it looks like real wild mouse roller coasters that exist, is what I mean. At the end of this switchback, we can have a an abrupt drop, a couple of abrupt drops. Now we can resume the switchbacks going the other direction, although the straight segments are inverted compared to the previous set. We've hardly even put a dent in our money with this. can't see what I'm doing. Let's see, how do I get back to the station? I guess we can just do it right here. Put some brakes here, so we, in case we're going too fast, we don't give our guests whiplash. And slither back into the station. Perfect. Although I really don't like the way that looks. Let's actually extend this part. Get a straight section. Much better. Put the brakes here. And I think we can get away with it a little bit faster, because these cars are so small, it doesn't take much to slow them down. There we go. Let's switch to... What colors do we have? Okay, it's just those two colors. Entrance and exit. We want the entrance right at the front, so it takes the minimal time to get guests onto it. I think the exit doesn't matter, so I'm going to put it over here. Because they can be walking off while the ride is running. Lift hill speed. Max that out. Test. Look 
Looks good so far. Not taking those turns too hard. That's good to see. Let's get some flowers for this blank spot we left. Because of the tree. I wanted to leave the tree. That's why I did that. That looks good. I think this ride is long enough we might be able to keep this minimum waiting time. Okay, now this guy's getting to the end. Let's turn this down. Now nah, let's just turn it off. Whatever. No limits to our throughput. Looks like most of our advertising campaigns have expired. Or no, all of them have. Okay. Resume that one. Wooden roller coaster. Turn these on again. Free rides on the Ferris wheel. And free lemonade. Come get your lemonade, people. What do we got? Ooh, I like that. Let's set the price to 14. See if people are willing to pay that. I think these stats are better than the wooden roller coaster. Yeah, look at that. They're better. Ho oh, ho! I could definitely charge that. Let's actually charge 15. Unless the roller coaster type affects how much you can charge for it. Although I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I can get away with this. Moment of truth for these guys right here. Nope, they're going. Although this guy ran out of money. <laughs> That's good to see. All right. Do any of our rides have... Okay, no one's paying for this. Go back down to the original price. Anything else? Okay, still nobody. I guess I just don't like it. Too bad. Turn it on down. I'm liking how this looks so far. We have two roller coasters, and this isn't actually a roller coaster, but it's like a roller coaster as far as its stats and its monetary performance. Let's just say we have three roller coasters. We have three roller coasters, a really nice looking wooden roller coaster, and a steel wild mouse. And I can't hear myself over this music. Okay, you've had your fun. Turn that off. <laughs> Let's paint this. This is fine for the rails, although I'd like the cars to be different. So first, let's pick a base set of colors that we like. The chairs, those can be a maroon, black for the highlight, or maybe white. Oh, I like that. Okay. Let's make this red. Different colors for car. Car 2, yellow. Car 3, blue. Car 4, green. Car 5, orange. Car 6, purple, or seven, white, and black. All right, we've got all the primary colors, all the secondary colors, white and black. Although we didn't get a light shade of blue, which is too bad. Dark blue is fine though. Okay, those are painted. Let's change the colors of these trains. Since our coaster has yellow as the rails, let's actually not have this be yellow. Let's have red, different colors per train. Train one, Train 2 can be a light green. There we go. I'm liking that. Let's change the entrance to this. Holy smoke, that's blinding. Uh, gray castle, just for variety. Look at these dodgems, they're doing great. Or bumper cars 1. Wait, did they change? Did they patch that? It used to be called dodgems. Huh. I. In the previous video, I went on about, or maybe it was the one before the last video, I was going on about how in, Eng in American English you just call them bumper cars as opposed to British English. But maybe it did say bumper cars, maybe I just assumed it was Dodgems because I didn't actually read it, I just assumed it was what it said it was before. Well, money-wise, we're doing great. We have our ad campaigns are still going, loan is paid off, and we have cash. Let's see, what do we have here? Do we have the cash machine yet? We do not, unfortunately. Although we do have glasses and t-shirts. Let's add some variety to our little, cert our, uh, what do you call this? Favors. Let's make t-shirts $5. Okay, they are selling. Someone's selling them. Someone is not, though. Let's, create, let's bring this down to four fifty. dollars see if that changes anything. Random color. Which means they'll essentially look like the shirts everyone's wearing already, because I think it is just randomly generated. <laughs> Actually, for that reason, let's turn that off and make something, make this something outlandish. Now, I always do pink. Let's do white. Everyone's wearing white shirts. 
And we haven't had any more sales. Why did you walk away? Did you... Okay, he just wasn't interested. Okay. Okay, so they are selling. Wonderful. Good to see. Let's expand a little bit this uh, segment here. Let's actually do it from here so we can consolidate that space. Should we wrap around... Whoop, that was way far. Zoomed way out. Okay, let's wrap around Splash Mine, actually. Or no, let's connect this. And let's have this wrap around the back. And go underground. There we go. I should probably change this, actually. Let's make this brown. Just in the visible parts. Oops. We can leave this stuff inside. That's fine. The water's edge. Bring this back up. And bring the land down. Let's actually make a hill. With this. No, I don't like that. This... Oh, crap. I did not mean to do that. Um, shoot. That's a major waste of money. You know what? Screw that. That's fine. We'll just have a random crater in the ground. Because I was an idiot. Okay. Loop that around. Has anything run out of it? Ended its prime yet? Okay, the maze has people on it still. Not a lot, though. Is this paying for itself? 500 per hour? Okay, that's good enough. Perfect. walnut tree right there so the guests can snack on walnuts or something that they find on the ground. Gross. <laughs> Ride's still doing good. This is cranking out moolah by the thousand. 23,000 per hour. I wonder if I could charge more than eight dollars, but it might be too late. Have a second one of those for our guests. Yeah, that's right. 20 bucks. What are we researching? Iced tea. And the last one was a pretzel stall. No cash machine. That's sad. I think our ad campaign's finished, so let's start those again. For the park. And for the steel wild mouse. Which is probably my best ride. Let's see. What's the money on this thing? Ah, not bad. I guess it doesn't have the best throughput because I didn't make more cars. Oh well, that's fine. Uh, it's 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 doing its thing. Free maze. Yeah, come make the maze. It's not profitable anymore. Free sandwiches, people. Come and get your free sandwiches. And there's the iced tea that we were waiting on. Come on, come on. Cash machine, cash machine. I need it. I never made a magic carpet. Silly me. You probably tuck that back here. No, probably not. Let's put it down here by our silent merry-go-round. Our soulless silent merry-go-round. Do I take less space if I do this? Hmm. Let's leave that as it is. Get some variety in our paths. There we go. Test. I think I can get away with $3 for this one. Bumper cars are still producing. Very nice, very nice. Well, this is a great start. We have multiple high throughput, high profit rides. Lots of smaller flat rides to kind of fill in the gaps and have options for the guests that don't like things that are too... Yeah, between 3 and 8, so he's rather picky. Well, not super picky. What is this guy like? More than okay, he likes everything. Um, we have options. Get every dime from these guys. We're also running out of foot space, I think. Let's expand. Let's uh add a section of path here to break up the crowdedness of our guests. 
Let's add some benches to it. Something I forgot to do over there. The new section we just added down by the water. Let's do that right now. Let's add benches. Right there. And these garbage cans, because why not? Just for variety. Twist one has broken down. How sad. Is this guy on it? Okay, he's on it. I just remembered, I saw that I could change the default window, or the default uh, inspection interval, the ten, 10 minutes. Perfect. I discovered that when I was playing with the settings to figure out why I couldn't get full screen to work. So let's have that set up. Did that automatically change this? No, it's still where it was when I built it. Okay. Let's change those right now. So we have less breakdowns, less downtime. Although I think we do spend a little more in, in uh, mechanics and their salaries because we have to have more to keep up with all the rides. Oops. Ten minutes. And splash mine. Still producing like a charm. Very nice. How's this one doing? Whoa, wait, what? Oh, no one's riding it. I'm not paying that much. Oh, that's sad. Okay, looks like the prime time is over. Down to 12. There we go. Someone's back in line. That's going to happen to Wild Mouse soon. What should we name this? Joust? The jousting competition? Because it's like they're jousting. They're dueling each other on these switchbacks. I don't know. There we go. Cote de Arms. I don't know if I spelled that right. <laughs> Let's see, what else can we name? Let's name the wooden roller coaster. Uh Creaky Hills. I don't know. Creaky makes that that makes the sound dangerous. I like this, but it's too loud and it's right in the middle of the park. So I'm turning it off. I'm sorry. If you liked it, I'm sorry. Forgive me. It had to be done. I had no choice. Let's keep those guys from getting upset. Okay. This is looking great. This is producing money again. Let's get our rates back up. Well, as soon as it calculates the average. Total profit, 13000 That's That's awesome. Our advertising campaign's just finished. Let's increase this to six weeks. Oops. Let's advertise... Wooden roller coaster again. We just named it Creaky Hills. That's right. Six weeks. And we'll advertise bumper cars, free rides in the bumper cars, and free lemonades. Let's add some variety to our food by adding pretzels down by the water's edge. Get this right. Can I dip this into the ground? Nope, I can't. I would have to move the land first to do that. Let's make this 250. Same price throughout the park. And iced tea. Although I might be a little late in the season for that. So it's get starting to get colder. <laughs> Two dollars. Let's have a bathroom down here too. There we go. Let's branch our pathways onto the water. And I find you can contain things like rowboats or bumper boats by building a path around them. So let's do that. Have a little looped section here. And... Force them to turn that way so they don't get caught up in here. Entrance right there. Exit over here so they have room. Boat hire. Probably should have built these before I... <laughs> I probably should have built these queue lines before I opened it. Okay. Very nice, very nice. How much can we charge for this? Uh, buck fifty. Whatever. I don't think anyone's interested. Yes! Cash machine! 
We are in business, people. Let's build some cash machines. Build one here. And let's build one down by the water's edge. Right there. Ah, one more. Just so we have multiple. Perfect. Now that we have those, we can... We have the capacity to produce a lot of money really fast. So let's bring the loan back up and start building some bigger rides. Let's change... Turn everything back on. Beautiful. Oops, turn this off. What can we build? Oh, we don't even have anything nice to build. <laughs> I guess that's what I get for turning everything off. Huh? I guess we should wait. Well, you can't. There's nothing wrong with building another wooden roller coaster. Let's just build a bigger one. A badder one. An incredible one. Let's build it off the ground a little bit. One, two, three, four. 20 feet in the air. Well, 20 feet above this level. Because back here's a slope. I need to see what's going on. So, plane entrance. Two trains. Maybe I should do three trains. So let me actually block section this. Okay, so we'll have a block section there, eventually. And this lift hill will be a block section. I think I ran out of room. Or no, I didn't. No, oh, yeah, yes, I did. <laughs> Great. This will be the first block section. Building in the air reduces the amount of time on the lift hill. And the lift hill can be a major bottleneck for block sectioned rides, so this is good. Whoops. Well, we're going down, people, into the ground. Get these ratings up through the roof. Look at this wonky helix thing we have going on. That's going to be fun. Let's add a loop, just because we can. Although I think that might be a little too fast, so let's see what let's see what our ghost train does. See if that we can get away with that or not. Although I have a, I suspect that's going to be coming a little too fast for that loop. We're going to probably break some people's necks. <laughs> Here it comes. Lose some momentum. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, we're fine. I was worried that wouldn't work. The problem with wooden roller coasters is the intensity to an excitement ratio is, well, the, it's more you typically more intense than it is exciting. So a common problem you run into is a loop makes the intensity too high, especially on a large roller coaster. Despite this, I'm going to try something radical. Okay, I was at 25 there, so I'm going to go back 25 again. Do I have room to pull this off? I need to see what I'm doing. Turn off vegetation. Okay. Left. Okay, that's not going to work. Maybe I have to do it from this side. Right. Left. No. Okay. Or do I need to be lower? Maybe I need to be lower. Here we go. Left. Yes! A loop through a loop. That's beautiful. Alright. So that's good. Although we have a land problem, so let's adjust that again.
Well, that's not going to work. We have this in the way. Huh? Actually, let's just make this go underground a second time. So let's lift this up just a little bit. Never mind, I can't do that because I forgot this is here. Uh, we're, we just pinned, we just cornered ourselves. That's not good. I think I have to go left. I don't have a choice. I must go left with a tight bank here. Let's increase this. There we go. And can I, can I squeeze under this segment? Yes, I can. Okay. And I forgot all about... I was going to block section this. Never mind. I'm not going to block section it. <laughs> it's too late now. <laughs> Great. What's in my way here? Oh! That's the edge of my park. That's not good. How are, how are guests getting stuck? There's nowhere to get stuck. That's weird. Maybe I need to put some signs making saying no entry to all those little exits. Uh, well, this is a problem. Unless I turn... I was afraid of that. Can we make a wide turn? No, we cannot. Okay. Um, what is happening? Now that's a glitch if I've ever seen one. Okay, we're no, no, still there. Dang it. And there's a hill there. Can't do that. Okay. I think we have to... Sneak through here. Can I do this? Can I do this? Yes, I can do it. Okay. That's good to see. Can't do that. I don't have a photo section, so let's put one right here. Can I get out? No, I can't. That's not going to work either. Hmm. Oops. Ground's too high for that. Ah, okay. Well, let's have a little lift there. Then photo section. Then down. Oh, but then we don't get as close to the edge as I wanted. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Photo section. Straight piece. I think we need another straight piece. I try to avoid having straight segments like this, but the truth is there's nothing wrong with them. I just... Uh, I, I have a... They're not my preference. That didn't solve our problem either. There we go. Little airtime hop right there. Perfect. I think we should have sufficient momentum to pull this off. Although, I'll need to turn one more time. This is the end of our ride. Let's slow down the train with a water section. Also because that increases the excitement rating. Turn. Down twice. And turn again. And we are perfectly lined up to go back to the station. Now I think having straight section here. Oh good, that's two. Perfect. Okay, I've reconnected the circuit here. I added back a segment of station. So we have a second train. So let's uh, add an entrance and an exit so we can test this properly.
Okay, train one's about to go over the hill. Let's see what she does. And let's watch our vertical G's and our lateral G's. This all looks good. Oh, I lost the... Oh, no. I'm not sure why it does that. Maybe I have to close this and reopen it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it took that loop really hard. Okay, that's not bad on the lateral Gs. That's good. Oh, snap. That's not good. Close. Okay, that could have been really bad. <laughs> I almost had a collision. Let's delete all this and rethink our roller coaster a bit. So we've pretty much lost all of our momentum by this point. Maybe we should just play around in this area, make drop and go down again, and maybe have a lift hill at the end. I don't know. Uh-oh, that's not going to work. Can I wrap around here? Oh, I can. Look at that. That's good to see. Although I can't do that because the track is in the way. I was afraid of that. I can go over that way. Okay, let's turn the test thing on again. And quack the duck, because we have to. We have no choice. Um, hmm. I guess we lose out on the... What do you call it? The... We don't have the splash anymore. Although I guess we could put it here. Never mind, we can't. Just, there's no room for it. Lift hill, turn, lift hill. Look at that. Very nice. Takes that loop way too hard. <laughs> and we have more stuff going on here to make it more interesting. Very good, very good. Up you go. Up you go again. We have another pretzel just like the one we had. Oh no, the pretzel's on this roller coaster. Never mind. Okay, let's test it. And what was that notification? Swinging inverter ship. Okay. While this is testing, let's actually build that over somewhere. Let's put it right here. Test. Change our path, to, uh, path type back to what it was. Okay. Let's go back to car one. Follow this on main view. Vertical G's. Oh snap, that's a lot of G's. <laughs> well, this is looking very good. This is a ride with a much longer duration than the other wooden roller coaster. Okay, I forgot to change this, so we have to test this all over again. Let's restart that. Splash mine is broken down. All too bad. We are making lots of money. As I said, those cash machines make a huge difference, because when guests run out of money, they leave. But if they don't run out of money because they can go to a cash machine, they may or may not stay. But if they do stay, they could end up spending tons and tons of money on the rides, just over and over and over again. They can't find Pretzel Stall 1. Why not? Where is it? Did I build it in the air? Oh no, I built it in the air! <laughs> oh, snap. There we go. Silly me. Okay. Follow this in main view. Through the pretzel. And we are experiencing technical difficulties. I'm not sure what just happened there. <laughs> Our screen froze. That's annoying. 
Okay, what's the damage? We go underground. Oh, jeez. That's a bit much. Although, despite that, our excitement is still pretty good. I wonder what I could remove to make this a little gentler. Ah, hmm. Well, maybe I have to just get rid of this loop. Uh, I really don't want to. Let's get rid of this one instead. Hold on, what does this connect to? See through vegetation? Oh, that's right! Aw, oh, dang it, because the loop moves everything over one. So I can extend that. Up. Up again. Level out. Now this will be a serious problem. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, here we go. I like what I see here. Oh, <laughs> we fixed it. And we got some little airtime hops in the middle, too. Now let's test it. Fast forward that, because I'm not patient enough to find out what it's doing. What are people not riding on? I forgot to open this. Let's change this to four. Let's see if people are willing to pay for that. Oh, yeah, right away. Big time money. I mean, look at those stats. Of course they'll pay that much. Bumper car is only seven people. Oh, that didn't even... That hardly put a dent in it. Uh-huh. That's a problem. Hmm. What in this ride is causing that? We have 4.7 vertical Gs here. That could be a problem. It might be that they're taking these loops too hot. Let's, uh rethink these a little bit. <sighs> I don't want to do this. Maybe I just have to get rid of the loop. That's sad. We could have a little drop right there. That'll make things interesting. Bank, and good to go. I was afraid that having multiple inversions would be a problem in this thing. Because it is a long wooden roller coaster. And they tend to be excessive on the excitement or the intensity rating. No! What? Ah, what? Come on! What must I do to bring down the excitement? Oh no! You know what? I'm tempted to just delete this. And just start afresh because I don't know where I can adjust this. Hmm. Let's test it again and follow it. No, no. Oh, no. Now I can't get my full value back because I accidentally opened it. Uh, test. Thank you. Follow in main view. So we turn into a drop here. The drop goes down really low. It's a big drop, as I wanted. Definitely some airtime right there. Let's look at how bad it is. Negative two. Another helix. Hmm. That turn right there might be a problem. You know what? Screw this. Screw this. Whoa, 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 why am I tra What the? What? I was tracking the, the money. <laughs> that was weird. I don't know what in the coding caused it to do that, but that was wonky as heck. Okay, let's start over. New wooden roller coaster. Although, do we have other types available to us? No. What, what's researching? Top spin? Ooh. That's what's coming up soon. Uh, never mind. Let's go. Let's get back to this. Custom design. Start in the same place. Two, three, four, 20 feet up. And two trains. Oh, wait, no. Let's. We have a second chance at the block section, everyone. 
Let's maybe start this a little lower so it's not so bad. Here we have an 80 foot drop because we have, this is, oh no, that's 20 feet, so this is 70 feet. No, 80. Ah, I can't do math. <laughs> the ground is, the ground is 30. So, yes, I think that's an 80 foot increase from the starting elevation. Let's turn it as we did before. Can I sneak under this? No, I cannot. Okay. That's not going to work. That's not going to work either. Um... Can I sneak through here? Oh, I can. Look at that. Let's uh, lift this. Let's elevate this a little bit. Never mind, I can't do that. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. In preparation for another drop. And like a charm, we don't run into this track piece here. That's beautiful. Looking good. Although I think I need to block section this now. So let's get up to about... How far will this go up before it stalls? So we have... Do we lose 30 feet vertically in momentum at this point? Let's see. Do we make it all the way up? Not quite. That's too bad. All right. Well, let's change this. Shrink this down to 65 feet. Will he make that? Oh, he does. Beautifully. That is awesome. Okay. Can we dive into this spiral we made? From 65 to 50 feet, that should be possible. Okay, perfect. Let's slide this bad boy underground. By straightening out right here. That's not going to work. Okay, let's see what's going on. See through vegetation. See through supports. Oh yes, there's a piece of ground, there's a piece of land right there that we have to lift. There we go. Put a photo section right before the entrance to the Tunnel of Death. Let's move this out of the way. All right. So we dip into the ground. And I think we can loop right here. He'll expect on a ground level. 
maintain the, the roll. And through the loop. That's good to see. <laughs> it's just tangled. We just tangled this thing up. All right. This is looking so cool. Let's turn sports back on. Turn this off because we no longer need it. I actually need to see how hard it goes through this loop because that might be a never mind. Oh, look at that. Barely. Just barely goes through. That could be a problem if the guests all sit in the back and it's a partial train. So, hmm. How do I fix that? Where can I consolidate to get a little more momentum on this? Perhaps right here? Okay. A little more, have a little airtime hop right there. Can I reconnect to this? Oh, look at that. I think that will be a problem. That will probably cause a crash. I'm not sure how the game is programmed to deal with stuff like that. So let's see what happens here. <laughs> will it crash? Yep, that's a crash site. You cannot do that. That's dangerous. No, 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 no. Come back. Okay. We can't do that either. Oh man. Okay, I guess we have to keep this as it is. Unfortunately. Can we connect these the way they were before? Oh good, we can. Perfect. Now let's see if having that change in the curve there allows us to take this loop a little bit faster. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Loop! Ah, uh, it's no better. Oh, never mind. Well, this doesn't look good, so I'm changing it back. <laughs> and I suppose we'll just have to pray that we never have a stall right here. Could we increase this? Let's make this go up a little taller. I don't know if we're going to be able to pull this off, but... Um Let's go down one. There we go. Problem solved. Oh, <laughs> look at that. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you design a roller coaster in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. So I'm certain that's going to make it just fine. So let's get back to this. We can probably put a block section right here if he makes it up the hill. Let's see if he makes it. Okay, that looked like it was alright. Do you have enough momentum? I doubt it. Nope, that wasn't going to work. Darn it. Alright, well in that case, we'll put a block section here. Ish. Or not. What is up with these graphics glitches? So actually got the 45 so we can make it to the so we can do a what do you call it and ah, never mind 40 I seriously doubt it's gonna make it up this block breaks will go there Okay, it struggled, but I don't think it's going to get stuck there. That was good. Can you make it up 10 more feet? Up to 40 feet? Go, 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 go. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That is perfect. All right. Let's see what we're doing over here. All 
That's not gonna work. Let's end the roller coaster now. But I have to line this up just right. So. Okay, that's good. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. Let's. This will serve as a block section right there. Did that wrong. Okay, yes, this will work. Okay. Now, let's test this. First, we got to... We have to add our block sections. Block breaks. And... I think this was a block section. Let me see if I'm doing this backwards or not. Yep, this is block breaks. Okay. Block breaks. Switch that to three trains. And, of course, I need an entrance. <laughs> I always forget to add that. The tail spin is where it should be. Okay. Now what we're looking to see is if this gets bottlenecked anywhere. I hope it doesn't. Okay, it goes right over the edge. That's good to see. Let's also watch our vertical Gs here. Make sure we don't have any, anything too aggressive. Okay, this one just got stopped. That could be a problem. Nope, nope, nope. I goofed. I completely goofed. I raised this thinking it would make this better, but I forgot that I had a block section here. Ah, oh, man, that's annoying. Hmm. Let's, instead of having that be a block section, go up until it stalls. Eighty feet. Little bunny hop there. That'll be fun. That also adds... Oh, no, that doesn't add another section. Okay. Follow main view. Looking good, looking good. Glide right over that block section, and down we go. With a little more velocity for that loop. Come on, come on. You can do this. Very nice, very nice. Took that loop very gently. You just got stopped. Yeah, this is all wrong. He has to get past there before... Oh, this is a problem. Hmm, I hate... I hate using block sections. <laughs> They're so hard to work with. Uh, this block section needs to happen sooner, I think. So let's remove this. Rethink this whole section of the coaster. This will be the new block section as a lift hill. And I think I just blocked myself. I don't think I can reach this anymore. Uh, can I? Okay, so it's slightly off center. Can I do this? I cannot. Okay. Instead, retain this. Now it's in the way. It's, um, the loop? No, it's this. Okay. Still in the way, so that's not going to work. 
Let's bring this up to 65 feet. So we have a little more headroom. Hey, there we go. That might make this tail segment too long, though. Okay, we're saying if anyone gets stopped, if anyone gets stuck by the block brakes. This would make sense, because it's just getting started. Now that we have everything going continuously and the first train circling back to the station, this is the moment of truth. Will anyone be stopped by the block brakes? Or will they be free to move? Okay, he stopped for a moment, and that caused him to stop. Uh, that's a forgivable offense, I suppose. Just for a moment. Although, this one won't be stopping here because they'll be held up by passengers getting in line. So, let's try this out. What's the stats? Very nice, very nice. Okay, we spent so long on this. Oh, and look at how rich we are. 45,000. Boom. All because of those cash machines. All right. Let's add our... Our entrance paths here. Okay, and do I have room to get all the way down from here? I do not, unfortunately. So, sideways like that. Open for business, people. Okay. Let's return to our advertising campaigns. Max that out because we have cash. Wooden roller coaster too. Uh. It's Wooden Roller Coaster 1 now, actually, since I renamed the first one. Free food or drink, free pretzels. Free rides on Cote de Arms, I suppose. Nah, that's too much. Uh, hmm. Magic Carpet. And now, in all this time, what rides are too expensive? Pirate Ship? Okay, no one's on this. Let's drop this down to 250. And people are returning, that's good to see. What else is zero? Magic carpet? No one's on. Oh no, people are on. Never mind. It was just unloading or something. Twist. No one's riding it. There we go. So those are fixed. Look at this. Beautiful. And because this has to stop to load, that adjusts the, the waiting time for these trains. So I think... We may have overcome our problem. No one's going to be stopped, I hope. I might be able to add a fourth train to this. Hmm. Yeah, let me let me get all their money first. <laughs> Close. <laughs> Four trains. Let's try that, see if anyone gets stuck. Okay, that is causing people to be held up. But it, it did improve the throughput just a little bit, maybe? While they're loading up, this one is coming over. No, that's not what I need to do. To improve the throughput... Let's turn that back down to three. I need to re I need to delete all this. This is this stuff is useless. Get rid of this.
Um. Yeah, that's not going to work. Um, let's get a wider turn all the way out here. Get rid of all this. Keep that one at the top. Now let's try that. Although I don't know if this is going to make it all the way up. Let's speed her up. Actually, no. Give me four trains. Whatever we can do to maximize throughput. Yes, there we go. As soon as a train pulls out, another train pulls into the station. That's good. Well, we can't have those trains running into the butt of this one, though. Okay. Let's see what happens with guests. Speed it up. Why are people turning away? I'm not paying that much. Oh, I guess it's past his prime already. That sucks. $14. <laughs> I guess I did knock down the ratings a little bit by reducing, uh, eliminating that section of the track. Like a charm. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. I guess it doesn't really matter if trains get stuck out here, as long as there's always a train pulling in as soon as one pulls out, because then you're always cranking out money. What's the rates on this? Going up, going up. 42,000. Woo! Is that going to keep going up? 47,000? 52,000. Holy smoke, this thing is a monster. Woo! 55,000. All right, that's that's amazing. Maybe it's gonna keep going up. I don't need to know. Well, just for just for kicks, let's see how where this maxes out. Fifty-eight thousand. Okay, I think it's starting to plateau. Okay, fifty-eight thousand eight hundred. I think that was the limit. Somewhere in that somewhere in that zone. All right, what do we have now? Oh, we've had a lot of stuff come up since since the. Uh, since I've been playing around with that. Let's add a top spin or a vomit machine, as I fondly call it. <laughs> Switch the mode up to the most sickening. Because that means we can charge more money for it. Scenery. For no apparent reason. Four bucks. What's the stats? No results yet. Okay. Oh, that's a horrible nausea rating. Goodness. We should probably add some first aid stations, because I didn't even cross my mind to do that. Let's put it right there by the exit. Let's have a few more interspersed throughout the park. Put one right here. There's nothing going on over here. Let's put a roller coaster inside this spot right here. Maybe a looping roller coaster. This will be fun. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Booster. Yeah, I don't trust that to make it. Let's start the chain sooner. I forgot I have that track piece. Let's actually put that right here. 
I have five feet of extra space. Let's go up. Let's reduce this hill by by five feet. There we go. I wonder if I can tuck a loop in here. Loop left. Nope, not quite. Let's put a photo section here first. Now try it. Loop left. Not right, left. Yes, we can. Look at that. Beautiful. All right. Now we need to make room for our stations. Uh, hmm. If I put that there, can I fit paths under this? Yes, I can. Okay, that's all I need to know. Did I just turn through that loop? Oh! I've never been able to do that. That is so cool. Oh, I screwed it up. Okay. That makes me giddy. That is so cool. Although, let me see. How bad is that going to be? How fast does it take that turn? Am I going to am I going to give people whiplash? Down to 18 and station. Okay, that looks good. There we go. Test. First, first, first. Lift hill speed. And test. What have we got to work with? Should I leave this color? I'm not sure I like it. I mean, the black and blue is kind of cool, but I don't know if it fits with the theme. I'm definitely going to change this color. Let's make this... Let's make this whole thing purple. With white supports. And the complementary color to purple is yellow. With yellow trains with purple highlights. Beautiful. Took that turn a little harsh, but that's all right. I'm going to assume that I can get away with about 14 from this one. But let's see for sure. I don't think I added a photo section to this, did I? Oh, no, it's right here. Never mind. Okay, those ratings aren't good enough. I have to knock this down to maybe 13? Does anyone get in line? Oh, I didn't make the key line. Whoops. There we go. Quite the wonky key line, if I do say so. Okay, people are getting in line. That's good. Let's see if they'll pay a little more. 14? Maybe? Please? Oh, they are! Oh, yeah! That's awesome! How's the boat hire doing? Are people getting ticked at the length of the length of the line for this? What are you people thinking? I want to get off, then return to the... Ugh. These are always a waste of time. <laughs> Why did I even build that? It's purely aesthetic. That's all it is, is aesthetic. Now I'm confused. Where are people getting lost here? People are still paying $8 for this? Maybe I could have charged more from the get-go with that. No one is on this. That tells me that 12 is too much for our frugal friends. Oh no, not $1. That's bad. 10 There we go. Will people pay $10 for this ride? Still? What? What's the rate on this? Okay, $8. Have it your way.
Okay, so they'll pay eight dollars, whatever. This one is still a money-making machine. Fifty-seven thousand per year. No, per hour. What am I saying? Perfect. How are we doing in ad campaigns? Looks like they expired. We are in April of year three. So we have about a year and a half left. Let's advertise our new looping roller coaster. Coach de Arms is broken down. Free ice cream, everyone. Get your free ice cream. Free rides on creaky hills since my people are stingy. All right. Looking good, looking good. What else do we have here? We have a spiral roller coaster. Eh, I'm not really into that much. We did one in the last scenario. They're kind of weird looking. Enterprise! That's good to see. Let's put it over here. Test it out. No results yet. No entry, please. Let's do another one of those right here. Keep out. Okay. Reduce confusion in our pathways. Like these guys. Where are you going? <laughs> You're not supposed to go in there. That's the exit. No entry. Oops. This thing can charge a lot for a flat ride. Six dollars. Because of its ratings. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, that's what people are willing to pay. All right. I feel so sad that I killed the merry-go-round. Can I? Okay, I'm pretty sure that's not a copyrighted song. I'm going to assume... <sighs> I'm not going to assume anything. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. <laughs> I'm scared. Let's turn something else on, shall we? Let us... What are, what are the options we have? Rock style? Uh... Let's see... Mechanical stuff. That's cool. Man, I'm moving in my seat to that. That's fun. What rides have no people? Coat the arms? Why not? Oh! It's because we're not willing to pay that much. Okay, $13. They're willing to pay that. Alright, good. Merry go round. Okay, that's just a few people are getting off. All right, we're in business. What should we build next? Let's build another roller coaster. Let's build a wooden wild mouse. And let's build it. Where should we build this? Let's cram it into this tiny little space here. Two, three, four, five, six. It's hard to get much height out of these. have a gentle sky view of this thing. And now comes the drop. Woohoo! Okay, I can't do that because I need my entrance. something magical about these wooden supports. They just look so good. Sorry, tree. It had to be like that. Can we get down the ground level?
30 feet. All right. Oops. Let's see if he rides. I can't see what I'm doing back here. Oh, there's a, there's a twist in the way. Oh, no. Um. Sheesh. Uh huh. Well, I really need to use up the momentum of this thing before I return to the station, so. This might do the trick. I can't see what I'm doing. See through supports. Because this ride has no brakes. That's a serious problem. Test. Oh, wait, no, don't test. Let's crank up the lift to speed first. To the max. Car one. See through supports. Lateral G's. That's going to be the kicker on this one. Especially at the end, I suspect. Just poking along all nice and easy at the top. And woohoo! That's a lot of G's, but it's alright. I love how they like lean when they go over the turns. It's almost like they're about to fall off the track. <laughs> and I can live with that. That's good. That's very, very good. Alright. Turn this off. Ooh! 8.59. That's not bad. Let's uh, turn off the waiting time. That's a problem. Build our queue line. Boom. I love the aesthetic of these wooden supports, but it is so hard to work in there. You can't see a thing. Oops. Open for business. And $15 because of our fantastic stats. And people are going in. Look at that. Too intense? Oh, you, that's what you think. Look at this money. We're almost to 100000 in year three. Woo! That's what I love about pay per ride parks instead of pay per entry parks. Yeah, let's just build Hawk's Nest. I'm not really much into these. No, 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 no. Wrong type. Uh, come back. Hawk's Nest. Where do I have room for this? Right here? That's good. Let that test. Okay, that's weird. We have floating hedges. Um, let's cover that up. There we go. It didn't really do much, but whatever. <laughs> it kind of covered it. Which of these rides have expired? They need to have their prices reduced. Ah, nothing. Okay, good. That's what we just learned. Hair inverted hairpin coaster. What have we maxed out? Nothing yet. We're still le we're still learning. All right, that's good to see. Let's crank up the time on our park. Oh my, this looks so good. Open for business. Let's try eight dollars. I didn't even look at the stats yet. Oh, I can do more than that. Let's do twelve. Boom. There's a problem with this ride is throughput. Uh, I guess they're probably going to get horribly bored in this queue line. Am I saying that wrong? Is it a queue line or is it a cui line? I think I've heard it both ways. Correct me in the comments, please. I'd like to know how to say that correctly. <clears throat> I could just Google it, but it's easier to make you tell me. <laughs> that's also that's also uh, audience engagement. It improves my stats. Makes my videos get recommended to people, and that's beneficial. It helps my channel grow. What can we put out here in the water? Oh, it looks like we've exceeded 100,000. I wasn't even paying attention. That's great. Mechanical theming? Good to see. Good to see. Let's, uh, make this thing fiery. What should we call this? Uh, conveyor belt. That's what we're going to call this ride. Conveyor belt. Part of our factory over here. 
That's what I should have done in the factory caper scenario is something like that. That's cool. Oh, that's annoying. No, 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 no. Don't go there. Okay. Put that on the loop. This on the other side of the loop. Oh no, it has to be the same one. I just gotta turn it around. Or no, I don't. I gotta switch it this, uh... No. There we go. Perfect. Okay, that's not perfect at all. <laughs> I hate how it lines up like that. You think it's lined up, and then you change the angle, and it's completely not. Whatever. It's decoration. Want to keep those colors. Something I have to think about when I make these videos is where do I take my thumbnail screenshot from? The first one looked so good. All the rides were close together, and it, it was great to take a, a great thumbnail picture. But then Factory Capers was a little more tricky because all my roller coasters were so far apart. So I know I'm supposed to produce the- I'm, I'm making this video for the sake of the video, but I have to think about that as a content creator. What are people going to click on? And where do I need to place my roller coaster so it looks good in a thumbnail? Let's add to our park. Let's build... I like Texas tubs. I know it's a pre-built, but whoa, whoa, whoa. There's not a whole lot going on with these kinds of roller coasters. There we go. Now these don't produce much, so I can't charge much for it. What is happening with the theming over here? The heck? Okay then. Well, that's interesting. Anyway, uh -huh. open for business. That's a lot of notifications. What's going on here? My, no my ad campaigns are done. Okay. Let's restart those. 12 weeks for the park. Let's advertise Wooden Roller Coaster 1. Free food. Let's say free iced teas. And free rides on bumper cars. Why not? Okay, let's theme this one. Let's name this Seismic uh, Fissure. Let me see if I actually spelled Seismic right. <laughs> Let me Google that real quick. Uh, size, seismic. Okay, uh, that's what I was afraid of. I got my E and my I backwards. Perfect. Now, whoops. Oh, my gosh, that is not good. Uh, I know it always defaults to these muted colors, but I feel like I like the maroon better. It is kind of blinding to look at, though. Huh. Let's make this... Uh... You know, I don't know. Oh, there you go. Have the maroon up top. Yeah, I'm still not convinced. Go back to maroon. That looks weird. Different colors for train. Train one, I like it. Train two. 
You know, never mind. Same colors. All, all vehicles the same. Whatever. What do you think? Do they use bright colors like this? Does this look good to you as the viewers? Or do you prefer more muted colors? Let me know in the comments. Let's change this to Castle Brown as the theme. And... I'm not even going to bother with the music. Let's pick black as a complementary color to this. Not complementary as in like the opposite of red. I mean... It's a color that complements the theme. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I can't see what I'm doing. Not there. Not there. Not there either. Okay, that should work. That suffices. Okay, let's see what that did to our excitement rating. Probably not much. Looking fancy. Let's change the wooden wild mouse. You know what? I actually like this. It's perfect. I love those colors. This ride is looking a little boring. We have red supports. Let's make er, red tracks. Let's make the supports. Oh goodness. You know, I should have just left them. <laughs> Find the way they are. Uh, I already changed the colors of the cars. That's good. Let's change the stations on this to abstract. There we go. Ferris wheel. Let's get a canvas tent. How uh, cute. Okay. Twist one, we have riders, that's good. Let's theme it, let's put the, make this a canvas tent too. Space, because, you know, Enterprise. Take our silent, soulless merry-go-round and get canvas tent with the wrong color. All right. Oh, I missed a few. Eh, it's fine. Why do I bother? Castle Brown. Castle Gray. Because why not? Are these all the same color? Different colors per car. Come on. Obviously. What kind of bumper cars is the same color cars everywhere? Did I already do a pink? I can't remember if I did a pink already. I think I didn't do red yet. Let's get a light blue, cyan, and uh, ha, da, da, da. we have purple, we have blue, light blue. Whatever. You can't even see him. There's a canopy on it. Why do I bother? Oh. Eh, let's find the way it was. Nope, not that. There we go. Okay. Got a pirate ship here, which has supports in the water for some reason that I will never make sense to me. We need a ride out here to justify having this path here. So what should I build? Perhaps. What have we not built? We have all of those. We don't have all of these, so I'm not sure I want all of them. Let's actually make a crooked house, just because why not? Fine. 
fill this space. Price. Move it up to a buck. I don't know if that'll ever pay itself off. <laughs> it looks like Seismic Fissure has expired. So let's turn this down to 12, sadly. And people are, will they still turn away? Oh, we got people. Okay, never mind. Circus. Let's add a circus. Seems properly medieval, if I do say so. Let's change this to canvas. Match the color of the tent. Lovely. While this is coming together swimmingly, how many roller coasters do we have? We have one, two, three. Not counting this one, four, five, six, seven roller coasters. And if you count, if you count Splash Pine, that's eight. And we have lots of flat rides interspersed throughout the park, not all crammed into one spot. Let's build an observation tower right at the heart. We start at 30. Plus 200, let's go up to 250. There we go. Get a nice view of everything below. Let's actually make it uh, go up to 300. There we go. Well, that's testing. All right. Fast forward, what are we learning? Initial, oh, a shop style, okay. What was the last thing? Oh yeah, the circus, that's what we got. Let's build another roller coaster. Let's build a third wooden roller coaster over the water. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two trains, good to see, good to see. Starting at negative 5, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100 feet off of the water. I should go taller so I can get back down to the water. Okay, I went too high. 100 feet, so 105 feet. There we go. Let's make this roller coaster one of, there's like two basic kinds of layouts. There's a roller coaster that winds in on itself like this one. And then there's a there and back coaster. Most of these are kind of somewhere in between like this one. It's kind of there and back. Let's make this one a there and back layout. There and back again, a Hobbit's Tale by Bilbo Baggins. 100 to 80, that should, that should work, I think. That's a problem. From 80 to 65. We haven't done a whole lot of building at diagonals, have we? See through supports. What am I stuck on? It's the ground. Okay. Let's turn that on and lower this. What do you mean wooden roller coasters on the way? No, it's not. <laughs> Give me a break. And let's just try to save money here. There we go. Mm -hmm. 
Can we do 65 again? Let's not. Let's actually go to 45. So every peak is about 20 feet lower than the previous one, approximately. Turn supports back on. Whoops. Want to bank that. There we go. Let's actually keep that straight for a second. Straight again. What is going on with my graphics? Whoops. Back to 60. Nope. Down to 40. Now I have lots of momentum, so instead of going straight back to the station, let's keep it going over here to kind of wear out the momentum of my train. There we go. That was a mistake. Hop over itself right there. Water splash. Get a photo of all your wet faces. So that's what we like to see. Not yet lined up. Oh, I'm still in the air. Down, flat, turn, brake. 13. All right. And there we go. A there and back coaster. What a beautiful layout. Look at that. This looks like a Six Flags roller coaster, doesn't it? And set the lift hill speed to fast as possible and test. All right, let's build, let's make this path green because why not? And we can maximize, we can increase excitement by building over the, the track for some reason. actually bring this down a little in a different spot. Down you go. All right. Good to see. Good to see. Set the price. I'm assuming this is going to have a recent, a de uh, decently high excitement rating, so let's set that to $15. see what the test results are. Ooh! Wow! Those are mega stats for a ride like this. Awesome! Let's bump this up to a $16. We can easily require that from our customers. Why is my park rating going down? That's not good. Come on, peeps! River Spirit. 
And to go along with that theming, let's change the style here. Okay, I like that cyan, but let's change this to white. Maybe make the supports blue. Okay, never mind, this just blends in with the water. Uh, what other shades of blue do we have to work with? Oh my goodness, that is third. That is completely blinding. Wood? Eh, I don't know, that works. It's not, not my first choice for colors. And for the cars, the trains, let's go with a light blue. Or no, let's go with green, like seaweed. And yeah, that's that's good. I like it. Merry go round is broken down. How sad. Let's turn that off. That's annoying. <laughs> it was fun for a while, but that's getting old. Yeah, that's fine. Some fun peppy music. Oh yeah, I forgot I made this crater right here. I wonder if I could make this into like a pond. Nope, I can't do it. It's not going to let me. Now why is my rating going down? What are people thinking about? It's too crowded here, running out of cash, sick, want to go home. Oh, we have a vandal. I saw a vandal. This path is disgusting. Where are you guys? Oh, you're darn right it's disgusting. Good heavens. Where are my handyman? I think I need more. My park's bigger. It seems to be a hub of nasty. So let's assign this whole segment to one guy. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is a nasty path. Now let's uh, track down our broken scenery and fix it. Do we have any busted garbage cans? Yeah, we do right there. That's not good. More benches. Rating's going back up. There we go. See? Still going up. Get our paths cleaned up. Get the... Uh, vandalism fixed. What else do we have to fight to deal with here? Any more vandalism that I have missed? I don't see any. Something I notice when I go back and edit all these videos is I see all the, th the obvious things that you all probably see, but I totally missed while I'm in the process of recording. <laughs> We're still pushing back up, but we still have that red arrow. What are people thinking now? Crowded. Of course, it's got to running out of cash. Sick. Want to go home. Bathroom. Yes, we do need more bathrooms. Let's put one down. Oh, we have one. Okay. Let's put one over here. Still charging money for it. I guess I don't need that, so let's turn that off. Free bathrooms, people. Free the bladders. Bladders are no longer in bondage to exorbitant fees from crazy capitalists like me. <laughs> sunglasses. Let's have some sunglasses right here. I wonder how much I can charge for these. Three fifty? I'm not paying that much. Okay, let's try three dollars. Will you pay three dollars? He did. Okay, that's good enough for me. I'm closing this. What else do we got? Okay, we've maxed out our park rating, but we still have the red arrow. That doesn't make sense. Let's do actions. And find our vandal, wherever he is. Maybe he calmed down. I don't see him. Something that's weird in this game is vandalism isn't t isn't correlated to the happiness meter, although it's uh, usually the comorbid. That's probably the wrong word for that. Uh... But what's actually going on is it's from disgusting paths. So if they step on a path that's disgusting too many times, then they become vandals. Let's build more balloon shops. We are in year four. We are almost to the end. We are on the home stretch. 
Let's put some free balloons right here. Get your free balloons, everybody. Random color. Let's place a few more throughout the park. Let's put one there. Random color. I think my first balloon stall is blue, so let's make this one green. Bright green. There we go. Let's have some balloons out here on the water. Color this. Purple. Oops. Random color. What's the money production? Oh, not bad. Not bad. The throughput's not the best because there's only two trains on this massive track, but it's still good. Yeah, I'm really loving that roller coaster. All right. How many of you viewers back when you played this game used to just quack the ducks incessantly? And yes, I just used quack as a verb. I mean, quacking is a verb, but I mean, it's not a verb a human would use to quack the duck. <laughs> I don't know why this, it's so satisfying quacking the ducks. Let's bring one of our handymen down here to clean up this mess. Let's mark this area, designate this as his zone to work in. I can't see what I'm doing. This roundabout will be his plus a little bit there. All right. Who dropped their balloon? You're supposed to hold those until the end. Look at that money. Crank this up, crank this up. 12 weeks. Let's advertise that new wooden roller coaster, River Spirit. 12 weeks. Free food, free ice creams, and free rides on the circus. Speaking of the circus, no people? I need to lower the price. No one's interested. Rotodrop! Ooh! I love the Rotodrop. Get some crazy excitement ratings with this. Well, crazy, not crazy excitement ratings. We can get some crazy intensity ratings with this. Oh, that's vandalism. Let's fix that first. That's a lot of vandalism. Goodness. Oh my goodness. How much vandalism is there? This guy's on a roll. Do I need to hire security guards? Who's doing it? Not thoughts, give me actions. So he's not walking unless he's off the screen there. Where are you? Somewhere. Oh, I think I missed him. You no, know, whatever. We're fixing it. We, we hired more handyman. It'll get better. Just just be patient. Our park rating is perfect again, so that's good. Let's build that rotodrop. Let's find a gap. Now we're not. Put it up there. Stick it in here. Now there's a specific height you can go, which is tall enough to get the maximum excitement rating, but not too tall that it makes it too intense, and I'm not sure what it was. So let's test this out. While that's doing its thing, let's get our paths back. Okay, was that it? Come on. Okay, it's too tall. I think that's several sections, several track sections too tall. No, don't open. Dang it. Let's take off three of those. Test again. Oops, didn't mean to click that. Let's build our exit path right there. And our entrance right there. Now we're still too high. We have to delete one more piece. All right. That should be good now. Open for business. And this can charge a lot, actually. I think I can charge, what is it, like $18 or something? Yeah, people are going right in. Good, good heavens. I think I can actually charge $20 on this. I don't remember. But, eh, I'm not going to do that. That's just too much. 
There we go. 964, 964. That's as far as I can push it without going too far. Now, what have we developed? We just developed the roto drop. Steeplechase, that's uh, kind of useless. Very old roller coaster from the old days. Let's build a spiral. Let's tuck it over here and kind of go over this hill. Oops! Too close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Spiral one way, spiral the other way. What's in my way here? Oh, that's not going to work. I was afraid of that. Can I go up here? I cannot. That's sad. Um... Nope, no, 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 no. Photo section. Our starting height was 100 feet. So 80 should be okay? I'm not certain that's going to work. Oh, that's great. That's good. All right. We're good. Let's turn this the other way. Get a major airtime hop right there. And can we pretzel this? No, we can't. I'm in the wrong spot. All right. We have to go straight first, I think, and then pretzel it. Yes, pretzel is a verb now, because I made it a verb, starting now and ending now. Beautiful. Let's change that. I don't know why I always default to the roller coaster that winds through itself. And I don't know why I do this, but it's just how I normally build. I think it's because doing a there and back layout is kind of difficult. I got lucky with this one. I'm not exactly good at it. Usually it just looks like it meanders and doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But I can make it wind through itself in a way that looks good. Is there anyone on this? Okay, good. Back to our spiral roller coaster friend. What's in the way here? Another angle. I am... Oh, I'm running into that. Okay. I guess I can't curve through there. Let's just go down. Let's go up and curve that. 70 is pushing it. I don't know if I'm going to make that. Never mind. I can't anyway. And I can't do that either. So let's just rock the passengers with a few curves. That man has no effect whatsoever on the excitement rating that I'm aware of. It just looks cool. Roller coaster starting to not make sense. Now I just have to pray that this doesn't have a collision because <laughs> I don't want to try to modify that. I'm getting too lazy. Rotate. Goodness, this is a long scenario. Crazy castle indeed.
All right, that's good enough. Oops. And test. Let's put something in the middle there. What do we have as medieval theming? There we go. Let's crank up the speed of everything. Six weeks remaining on our advertising campaigns. What are the rates? Okay, not nothing too fancy. Let's go 12. And open for business. Let's actually paint it first. What what are we doing here? Uh, white track and maroon reddish supports. No. Let's do a pink track and yellow supports. And for the cars, let's do a baby blue combined with dark blue. Let's actually reverse those. Baby blue there. And what's the opposite of blue? The complementary. Uh, blue, 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 orange. There we go. Very bright, very eye-catching. There we go. White rails, or white uh, bars in between the rails, so we get this pattern on the canvas roof. Texas Tubs is broken down. Well, that's too bad. I think I might need more mechanics. Yeah, I definitely need more. I only have two in the whole park. <laughs> I guess I've been saving money all this time by not paying their salaries. Let's follow these guys. Woo! <laughs> Just got thrown up against my restraints. That is a fast helix. Let's do this weird windy helix thing. Water splash, sploosh. Very nice. All right. This thing's still cranking out cash for us. Splash mine has never changed the amount of money I can charge. That's wild. How much money has this produced overall since we started? 62,000. Wow. That's a lot. What about this one? About half of that. This one still has guests. That's about the same. This thing, heh, <laughs> hardly squat. Only, what is that, one rider or two riders? I think it's one rider per car. What is, it's, oh no, it's two, okay. Two per car, and there's only eight cars, so I can only have 16 people on the ride per, at a time. Will anyone pay $4 for this? Okay, good, we've re-fixed uh, that. Conveyor belt, no one is on the ride. Is that because it's... Yep, it's too expensive. All right. Let's change this to 12. See if that brings people back. Yep, we got someone. All right, so that's good. Crooked House 1. Back down to 60 cents where it started. <laughs> no one wants to ride on it. Seismic Fissure. Zero people on ride. Why is that? Looks too intense. Not paying that much. All right. Really? I thought this was... I don't know about you, those are some pretty sick ratings. I don't know what y'all's problem is. <laughs> Seismic fissure. Are people getting in line or do I have to lower it again? Okay, people are going in line. That's good. And what else? I think that's everything. Okay. Keeping everything open, watching the prices. What's this thing doing? Ooh, that's not bad. We should probably build another one of these. Let's change the color. Let's make this bright red. There we go. Ah, uh, this is fine. I'll leave that the way it is. Park rating still 999. That's good. What else do we have? Oh, compact inverted coaster. Let's build a continuous circuit one of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we need that one right there.
This is one roller coaster type where you really have to watch the ratings on this. Or you really have to be careful, I mean. Because you will quickly make the excitement rating way too high. What's in the way? Is that the ground? Yeah, that's the ground. Let's get that out of our way. Get this out of our way. Let's have a vertical loop left. Very nice. That's not going to work. All right. From 55 to 45, I seriously doubt that's going to make it. What's in the way here? Oh, I'm in the way of myself. Okay. What about a photo section? Is that? Nope, doesn't work. Photo section there. Let's actually bring this up so it goes over the path. Can I go over the path with 10 feet of clearance, or is that a problem with this roller coaster type? Nope, it's not. That's good to see. Photo section. Looks like I can't do that there. Uh, snap. Okay, we'll delete this section of path for now. photo section there. Okay, now let's fix the path before I forget about it. There we go. Entrance goes here. Exit goes there. What track types do we have? Or coaster types? Just one. Alright. Fire away. Let's build the path. Whoops. I meant for that to go adjacent to the track, not under it. All right. So far, so good. First train is returned to the station, so we're going to get some results in just a second. Oh, look at that. Very nice. All right. Let's change this to 14. I think as I, I think I can get away with that. And open for business. We have a taker. What are these notifications? My marketing campaigns are finished. Oh. Huh. Well, I think I have until the end of October. Yep, October. So that's July, August, September, October. About three and a half months. So let's set this to add ah, 12 weeks. I have time. Let's advertise that compact inverted coaster one. 12 weeks. Free rides on why not the wild mouse and free food. Speaking of food, I need more food. We need variety. These poor guests are stuck on nothing but sub sandwiches, candy apples. Boom. Twelve weeks. For the sake of variety. Well, this is looking fabulous. Let's make a castle. Because why not? Okay, Portugal Ace. And some regular walls. Oh, 
Oops. Voila, a castle. Ta-da. Let's put some scenery out around it. We have the practicing grounds for our peoples. We have targets for the archers to train with. Now let's liven up this place with some foliage. It's a Aleppo pine tree? I have no idea what that is. Oak tree, get some acorns all over the ground for the little kids to play with. Who has memories as a kid finding uh, finding acorns and being so enthralled by them? It's like, whoa, they exist in real life, not just in movies? Yeah, I did grow up around a lot of oak trees, so it's always a novelty as a kid when I'd find one. <laughs> that makes me sound weird. I want to get the rating for the most beautiful park in the country. Oh, goodness, goodness gracious me. That is a mess. Handyman, where are you and what are you doing? You are failing to do your job, I think. Get this zone, let this be yours. That's one improvement from OpenRC22 that I really appreciate, is the ability to disable segments of territory that aren't this, what is this, 4x4 four four square? Because then you can keep them from going into the queue lines. Alright, so you clean that up. Yeah, back to scenery. Myers Blue Juniper Tree. Let's get some small trees here and there. Some more fir trees. Speaking of fir trees, my folks back home just got a Christmas tree a few days ago, the, uh, the day after Thanksgiving. And it is a fabulous tree. I think it's it was about 21 feet tall when we cut it down. And we shortened it a little bit so it would fit in our room, but we had a vaulted ceiling in my parents' house. I don't live with them anymore. I'm at a, I'm at a college apartment. But they have a fantastic tree. This looks like a candy ride. Well, I'm loving this. This looks good. Uh, let me get, get out of there. What are you doing in there? That's... Oh, this is someone else. Whoops. Let's see. As we are approaching the end of the scenario, let's place some more balloons. Well, first let me place that. Balloons! Do we have any down here? Yeah, we have one right there. Let's put one over here. Yellow. Ferris wheel has broken down. How sad. Do any of our rides not have people on them? Circus? Why is that? I'm not paying that much, he says. Okay. Make it cheap. Make, make you happy. Have your way. What's this? Pirate ship? Yeah. I'm going to have to retire some of these rides and just demolish them and build new ones. River Spirit. No one in line is because this is too high. Set that to 12. I could probably do 14, but I, I, I don't want to set it again later. And besides, we're not, it's not like we need money. Look at that park value. Woo! Or the company value is even better. Good heavens. Are people still turning away from this? <laughs> he just freaked out. He's like, oh, that looks like too, looks a little too intense for me. Let's put some retaining walls up to keep this from collapsing. Uh, what should we build it out of? Concrete? Ah, bricks looks better. Whoops, that doesn't go there. Okay, there we go, hide that bare dirt landscape. Let's make these uh, pathways a little more fun to walk on.
Oops, I messed up my trash cans. Uh, put that back. All right, so. We are in August 13. We have two more months left. Two and a half months before this scenario wraps up. Look how we filled this park out. This looks so good. I love this. Any new roller coasters I should be aware of? Nope. We have three wooden roller coasters. We only have one looping roller coaster. We can probably get away with another one. At least one other looping roller coaster. So let's put it up somewhere. I don't really have access to my path anymore. I kind of closed everything off. Whoops. Let's just put it up here. There we go. Make that go left. Actually, I wonder if I can double or if I can triple a loop. So let's do this. You did not just make it over that hill. That didn't make sense. I don't know. <laughs> let's put a loop right here. Loop left. I think I did this wrong. Yep, I was afraid of that. Right? That's also wrong. Oh, this is going to be tricky. There we go. Down again. And loop right. Maybe? Please? Oh, no, I'm not close enough. Whoops. Uh, how did I do this? Yeah, I guess it wasn't going to happen. Oh, <laughs> look, this train just completely stalled. <laughs> oh, well. Let's put brakes right here, because I'm going to launch this out of the station. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm going to launch this train out of the station. So let's, uh, first of all, entrance and exit. Put the entrance right there, the exit right here. This will be a little detour from the path. And let's set this to powered launch, passing the station. Let's try 31 miles an hour, just as a starting point. Oh, wait, I forgot. This is going to be a continuous circuit. Uh, uh never mind. <laughs> I guess I should shorten the station. There we go. Very good, very good. Very good. All right. And I think these brakes are redundant, so let me take those off. Or just lighten up the speed. Instead of actually, instead of, instead of accelerating that, let's actually put a photo section here. When I was editing this, the previous video, I realized I say actually a lot. So I need to check myself and not say that so much. Because actually, I say actually a lot. <laughs> I can do gray, although I like this better. Very good. Let's make this green. And no entry, because we want no confusion. No entry. 
Let's see what the stats are. Let's fast forward. Ooh, not bad. Not bad. Okay, let's, uh, well, first of all, open for business. Change this to $13. I think we can squeeze that out of our guests. Yeah, it looks like people are willing to pay that. That's good. And let's change the paint job. We have kind of a gold color going on here. And we can actually leave this looking gold. I kind of I kind of like that. Let's get a sapphire blue. And red. That doesn't work at all. Let's make the, the train red. And the highlight yellow. Eh. Yeah, that works. Okay. Although I kind of just blocked myself off from building anything else out here. What I should have done is made this into a, like a hub of some kind. Way, where, where are you all going? But what'd you get in line for? Ugh. Twelve. How about that? <laughs> now you're going to turn away. Are you kidding? Oh, gosh. Okay. Ten. How about that? There we go. Finally, people will ride it. Good to see. Our park value, 722,000 is our company value. Park value, 428,000. Not too shabby. I like it. Let's get ourselves one of these. Replace that tree. Let's plant another tree in instead. Cedar of Lebanon. Black poplar tree. Is that what this is? Poplar? Yeah. Honey locust. Let's get some palm trees down here on the water's edge. Why is this all, like, rocky? Let's actually make this a shore. Let's click sand. Let's get a beach going on. Okay, very nice. And I messed this up, so let's uh, change it back. Okay, now that we have a beach going on, let's get some palm trees. Let's get some, a variety of palm trees going on here. And... Some more decorative trees. Spark is being, becoming very pretty. Let's flank the entrance with these... What are these? Mongolia trees. Or magnolia. Yeah, magnolia trees. Replace that. Let's have a spacing of every two. We have one. Same on this side. Although we have a path here, darn it. Okay, I guess we'll skip that one. And there's a roller coaster there. Can't do it either. <laughs> we'll just move it over somewhere. Oh, whatever. Flowers! Let's get some flowers. Let's make this red. Oh, I can customize these. Red and yellow. Let's do blue and yellow. Blue and red. Oh, there's a tree there. Sundial. Let's put a. Never mind. I messed up all my colors. We now have over 300,000. Company value went down, I think. That's weird. I think we need to build more rides. Keep up with the times. Steeplechase! AKA useless. We don't have any junior roller coasters. Let's build one somewhere. We have room. I think we have room in the water's edge. Oh no, we have a back entrance so we can loop around here. Okay, let's build it out here. Elevate this. Two trains. Let's 
Let's see if that causes too many lateral G's. Going down all the way down from 65 to 0 with turns that are not banked. Twenty foot hop. Another twenty foot hop. Mini hop. No, I don't like that. Let's keep the track busy. Sixty-five to Ford. I think we'll make it. No, we no. That's not good. I think I need to add a booster here. Well, or we just do that. And return to station. Perfect. Entrance over here. Exit over there. Lift hill. Six miles per hour. Test. While that's testing, we'll extend our path from over here. let this one lift up, like so. There we go, perfect. Make this uh, yellow, whatever. Just a basic color. River Spirit just died. How tragic. the ratings on this bad boy. I'm getting tired. You can probably hear it in my voice. This has been a long session. Good heavens. I'm going to charge 8 per admission. Very good. Where's our mechanic? Okay, he's fixing it right now. Okay, good. What music should we turn on? Medieval style, because this is a medieval park. Oh look, we are almost finished. We're in the latter end of October, year four, and look at what we have created. This is so, so good. I love this. Let's get some, some dis, uh, conifer trees going. Spruce up the park. Why is my rating going down again? Looks like my ad campaign finished. Doesn't matter. Fruit trees. Pretty. Did I ever get an award for having the most beautiful park? Oops, wrong button. Let's see... No recent awards, that's sad. Oh well. This is making money. 300,000. Sweet. Park value went up, company value went up. I think just about a lot of the guests have balloons. So, does my nose sound plugged? It kind of is plugged. <laughs> oh, that's cold. I hope by the next video that my nose will no longer be plugged. I'll be over my cold by then. Hopefully, I'm crossing my fingers. Ah, uh, whoops. Why am I building stuff? The scenario is basically over. Let's look at what we did. We have one, two, three wooden roller coasters, two looping roller coasters, 
a spiral, a junior, splash mine, a wild mouse, a wooden wild mouse, an inverted, a compact inverted coaster, and this, uh, what do you call this, Texas Tubs? Uh, something real, Virginia real. Oh, and this over here. And all these other things, and man, this just looks so, so good. I am really in love with this park. This turned out so good. This is going to be really photogenic when I do the screenshot for the thumbnail for this. It's going to look so good. Company value of 786000 Woo! Holy snap. And we almost doubled the guests required to meet the objective. So that's, that's good. I'll just pat myself in the back a little bit, make my ego a little bit bigger. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. This was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And I will see all of you in the next video. Thank you so much, and bye-bye.